<laughs> Welcome to the Girdle Guys. Today we are doing candied slab bacon, and I'll tell you, Gracie is waiting for a piece. Hold on, Jeff. He's really in pain. You got him. You oh, got him. Good guy. <laughs> you got, yeah, I think you really got him. Yeah, yeah. yeah you hit the right spot. His acorn hurting. Hey, we got Gracie over here. We got slab bacon. This stuff is gorgeous. We have great ingredients. What could go wrong? Simple, quick, easy. Hopefully Thanksgiving was great. Hopefully you did our turkey cook. We really enjoyed it. And uh, this is an awesome appetizer for Christmas. Christmas parties, everything coming up. Quick and easy, flavorful, can't go wrong. Nate, you all right? No, no, <laughs> I'm not. Right, cheers. So I know I always say simple, but my turkey was simple. This is gonna be simple. We got Nate. So the basis of this is slab bacon. They have this at the deli. It's not too expensive, like $8.99, $6.99 a pound if you're at the deli. If you go to a butcher, which is where I got this, they smoke it in house. Looks amazing. But what we're gonna do is cut this in half, Chris's favorite. We're gonna skewer it. Oh, cutting bacon in half. Yes, yep. your favorite. So we got, <laughs> yep. and then we're gonna skewer it. And then we're just gonna start cooking it on the grill. And once it's about halfway done, we're gonna start basting it with our uh, concoction that we came up with here. So we're just gonna push this skewer through straight as we can. Dogs don't like bacon. No. <laughs> Look at that. She's chomping at the bit. Crazy, no. Crazy. All right, so that's not bad. So it went through okay? Went through okay. This takes me back to his uh... Oh, that. look at that, that's perfect. Is it the pinwheels? No. Yeah. Yeah, it was the pinwheels. Pin so now you can kind of use... 357 skewers to yep. a piece of beef. Yeah. I think Jeff just likes poking meat. You get the gist of that. So we're gonna skewer all these, and then what I'm gonna do is just slice right in between the skewers. So they're gonna be relatively thick pieces of bacon. I can't wait to try this, Jeff. This is one of my favorite things to eat at a fancy restaurant. Candy bacon? Oh yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah, it melts in your mouth. That looks awesome. That looks good, it came out good, Jeff. Mm. So, so we're gonna finish these up and then we'll do the, uh, the candy, candy recipe in a second. What do you think of a time, any idea? Probably gonna say cook it for 10 minutes slowly before we think about starting to. Chris, don't ask questions that irritate them. <laughs> <laughs> Do you keep flipping it? <laughs> don't, don't ask, he's gonna get angry. It's gonna be awesome. So anyway, if you want a number, 10 minutes. We're gonna do five minutes aside on low, and then go from there. But you're gonna see that these things are pretty thick, so we don't want it to be uh, chewed. Yeah, but it's candied, so it can't be crispy, because you're gonna have that right. sugar shell, right? But we also don't want the fat to not be rendered. You know, and, and to be too much or too tough yeah. because this is going to be thick pieces. So we got the bacon skewered. We're going to go and uh, put that down first. Griddle is on low, and that's going to be the key to this, to render the flat, uh, fat. Keep it nice and low. A little bit of oil down. Oh, yeah. Bacon. I put that shit on everything. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't see how you can possibly go wrong with this. This is a first for any of us. None of us has, have ever cooked this, right? I haven't, no. I cook this all the time. You Do you really? No. <laughs> <laughs> so how much, was that a half pound or a pound? Uh, this was two plus pounds. So you, right. you were close, Nate. I wasn't it's close. Not even. I was not <laughs> close <laughs> at all. Almost. But I was just gonna say, so you know if you buy a two pound piece, it's gonna fill a 30, well, 34 inch, I think this is. 36? 36. 36. Yes. No, 30, maybe Camp Chef 30. Yeah. It's the re equivalent of a 36, but I think with the Camp Chef it's a 34. Yeah. So. All right, you want to get your, uh, your sauce going, Jeff? Yeah, let's get to the, the glaze. I might actually make more. We're going to see how this uh, plays out, but anyways. What, volume wise? Yeah. You're afraid you're not going to have enough? I don't know. Yeah, because I kind of got extra bacon. I always tend to go extra. Anyways, so we have three quarters of a cup of brown sugar, two tablespoons rice wine vinegar and two tablespoons maple syrup. That's it? That's it. So that's gonna be pretty thick. Should be. Should that's be. gonna be tasty. Break that up. That's it, man. So now? How can that not taste great? Now we wait. <laughs> we want the bacon to be about what we consider halfway done, or medium rare. Check Chris it out for five minutes, you said, I think, right? Yeah, we'll keep it on one side for five minutes. Yeah. Smells good. 
How can it not? And that is brown sugar cured bacon as well. Smoked. What's the pin? Is, is, Five minutes? Six? No. Probably seven. Been about seven to eight minutes. So now we're going for our oh, first Oh yeah, clip. that's what you're looking for, Jeff. That Ooh, let good. me zoom in on that. Wow. Oh yeah. Well, we found the hot spot. Yeah. <laughs> smells outstanding. We are going to move the hot spot up there. Wow. This is low and slow. That's what you get. That is something pretty good looking so far. Smells good. So we're gonna only give this probably three minutes on the backside before we start basting. Yeah, we're just gonna give it a couple. I actually, I think I'm gonna stop putting some sugar on it now. Yeah, I agree. Oh, just on the backside, why not? Oh, you start hitting for you, yeah. Nice. Don't don't get ashes on my bacon, please. I thought you were gonna yell at me not to get grease on the camera. You no. can't say you're cooking bacon. That's not an option. What? <laughs> what? What's wrong, right? Man? Yeah, it doesn't bother you. I saw it. <laughs> I was leaning over here. You're gonna have a an inch long ash. About I got to drop it. I right got it, Chris. That. Yeah, I'll let you finish up. I'll go. I'll go back to my cigar. That's nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> So, seems pretty viscous, like it's sticking. Yeah. This is a winner already, I don't care. <laughs> Look, it All looks right. beautiful. It's a ting of beauty, Danny, ting of beauty. All right, ladies and gentlemen of Grill Nation, here's where we're at. Jeff has sauced one side. We're gonna flip, and our theory is... This has only been a couple minutes, too. It's only been literally a couple minutes, two minutes. Our theory is all this stuff that's on the griddle between the pieces, that's caramelized sugar. We're gonna base this side, then shift them a little bit, and it's gonna suck up all of that caramelized sugar on the griddle and coat the bacon. And then you wanna flip them again, right? Yeah. Yeah, base, flip, baste, flip, rub, right? Repeat. Smells outstanding, I and can't wait to try this. By the way, I did double the recipe for the uh, glaze because- I, I apologize know. for Jeff's face being completely black. The sun is not cooperating with us. He's uh, in a shadow. Chris and his face, I have no apologies for. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Good one, Nate. <laughs> it's just the way it is. <laughs> wow, that's the funniest thing you've ever said. Yeah, you know what? You might be right. <laughs> Smells a bit like uh, caramel slash cotton candy, right? Smells no, okay. great. I can't wait to try this. Even on yeah. low, just the grill. All right, so now we're, you're gonna do a flip again right away and a little, again right little away. smear. Yeah. Browning up perfectly. Looks good. Yeah, it is. It's getting coated nicely. This is going to be a two-handed scraper You can type, kind of huh? see some of the sugar stretching when he picks them up. A little bit of shrinkage. Yes. Mm. Yeah, we... <laughs> we'll leave the that. water was cold. We'll leave that one alone. <laughs> Definitely hot spot over there. Yeah. So we're going to continue on this low and slow. How much longer do you think, Jeff? I'm thinking probably only two minutes. I'm going to glaze one last time on this side and then flip it one more time. Hey, I'll give you 10 bucks to pull one right off the griddle and stick it in your mouth. It won't be that hot. <laughs> I, I smell. I think you could have tripled your uh, sauce recipe, right? Jeff. I smell caramel, what I smell. Mm. What do you think? It smells great. The only thing it's missing is butter. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That'd be the trifecta, Nate. Going to give this two more minutes. Uh, we might just flip it one time just to give it a little extra heat on that side and then pull it. Yeah, no one can see you, by the way. You're just a shadow because of the sun hey guys, behind you. Like, <laughs> right. subscribe if you've made it this long. I'll go closer. Quack. How's that? That's nice. We're done, actually. Wow. We've been flipping. It's been a total of about, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. Last step is I'm just going to put a little bit of pepper. Just give them a little bite. Go pretty. You've done good, Jeff. You've done good. Wow. We'll see. This is definitely going to be a candidate for the uh, two-handed scraper. Messy griddle is a good sign. Look at the string of syrup. I know. Yeah, you see the Look caramelized sugar. Smells delicious. Bacon looks nice and tender, Jeff. I have a feeling we're never going to be able to eat regular bacon again. It's possible. And for the record, my lights are still working. <laughs> really, yes, they are. Yeah, it really is like caramel. That's got to be almost a year ago now. Yeah. That is a plate to be desired right there. I don't think I don't I think you could do a thumbnail with that with no explanation. <laughs> right? Guys. Three, two, one. Done. Done. I like there's actually sugar strings hanging off the side like oh, yeah. cotton candy. All right, let's try these. Let's give them a try. Stay tuned after this. Nate's gonna clean this up. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, Nate's gonna do something. Guys, 
here we go. We have candied big ass bacon. Now, delicious stuff. Delicious stuff, low and slow, came out really good. It should be illegal. The, the bacon was still a little salty, but that may just be the bacon that I yeah, got. Totally. Because there yeah. was no salt in the uh Yeah, so pick, the glaze. A, pick a brand you like. But I'll tell you, the, the glaze on this, all that for a Yummy. second. Yummy. Like, you can't really, you can just see it. Like it, it, it's candy. Stringy sugar. It is candy. Impressive appetizer. Yeah. Have that out on the table. Yeah, absolutely. Great for the holidays. Hopefully everything's going well with you and your family. You won't guys, last everyone. Long. This won't last long. No. <laughs> but thanks again. Like, subscribe. See you on the next one. See you on the next one. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>